Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. I'm here with my stacker of a wife, Laura. I'm here with my create your own flavor husband, Nathan. And we're here for the new natural confectionery company, Fruity Stackers. We are, which apparently um, is going to allow us to build our own fun flavor. Yeah, so me and Laura had a chat before filming about how some of these flavor combinations end up tasting like other ones. So we'll have to see how that works. Yeah, let's have a look at the back of the pack so you know kind of what we mean. So um, this has similar flavors in it to the other Natural Confectionery Co. things. So they have, if it will focus, um, Juicy Orange, Crisp Apple, Luscious Raspberry, Tangy Lime, Delectable Smooth Banana. Um, that's fine. Yeah. That makes sense to me. Pretty standard. However, oh, it really doesn't, the camera really doesn't like these. Then it says build your own fun flavor or try some of our faves and it has some combinations to build here. So Laura's concern as well as mine was the orange and yellow. So orange is probably orange, orange. and yellow is either smooth banana. Well, it's going to be smooth well, banana. Yeah. So how does orange and banana make bubble gum? Um, pear, smoothie, raspberry lemonade are some of the other combos that they recommend. I mean, they're probably more achievable with what's in here, I would say. <laughs> Um, I guess we'll stack some and, and find out oh, how their boy. recommended flavors stack it up. Like? Oh, sweet. They're pretty good, yeah. actually. Mm. I like the Natural Confectionery Pro lollies. If I was going to buy a lolly to eat, um, this would probably be it. All right, so are we going to bother trying any individually? No, I think we should try their combos, because that's the whole idea of this, is to stack these kind of unique shaped lollies together. So they're sort of like, as if it'll focus... Yeah, yeah. Have yeah. little bobbly bits that you can slot them into. It really doesn't like these lollies at all. Now, are you going for a bubblegum combo straight up, are you? Hang on, I'm like going it for it. says on the back. Yep. So you can kind of... Click them in. I mean, I would say... Sit them in. Is click really the right word? Yeah, I mean, they're not going to stay together if you toss them on the floor. Don't, don't do right. that with your food, though. Let's try this bubblegum concoction. You don't like banana flavored lollies, too. I do not. Um, not at all. At least it's bubblegum, which you also like. No. Alright. Hmm. I'm getting a lot of orange. Me too. Mm. It's fighting with the banana, and the banana's losing. Mm hmm. Mm. I mean, I don't know what sort of bubble gum the people who put that on the back of the packet have been trying, but that's like no bubble gum I've ever had. Um, no. There's a slight aftertaste of like that pink bubblegum flavor. But really? It's, 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 you'd have to stretch pretty well. And I've just had the pink bubblegum flavor recently. <laughs> so. I tasted orange. Yeah, there was a little, I mean, they, 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 it's good, but it didn't taste like bubblegum. At no. All, really. No. no. I, I mean, I feel like when you're given fruit flavors, you should make fruit combos. Well, how about we try a raspberry lemonade? That I feel seems like, pretty I feel like that would make sense. So it looks like we must have a red, which would be luscious raspberry, and a green of tangy. Cri oh. Oh, crisp apple, or is it lime? That's interesting. I reckon it's going to be the apple. Let's have a look at our there's colors. No, there's no lemon. Hang on. Uh, so you got like a lighter one, which is probably, that's probably the lime and that's probably your crisp apple. I, I don't, I don't know. And what does it look like? Is it a dark green or? It looks like a light, light green because the pear's using a dark one. All right. So we're thinking that would be lime then. Yes. And like the. And the red for the raspberry. Yes. Maybe. Yes. Should I try this? Hang on, I'm just going to bite a little bit off this one to check. Oh, lime. That is definitely the lime. All right, and I'll try a, a pear, which is the banana and uh, I'm assuming apple because it's the darker green. Yeah. So I could see how raspberry and a lime could make like a, a, a raspberry lemonade sort of zingy taste. Except it's got no lemon in it. It's got lime. Well, you know, lime is a citrus fruit. Pear's an interesting flavor because pear's quite a light flavor as mm, a fruit mm -hmm. compared to a lot of others. Hmm. Hmm. Um. I get gone. I'm seeing a little bit of a problem here with that whole build your own flavor. They kind of act independently of one another. So with with the first one, we had the orange was just overpowering, and that was kind of all you got. With this raspberry lemonade one, I kind of felt like I was eating a lime lolly, and then I was eating a raspberry lolly. It doesn't really go together. I mean, they are nice lollies. Don't get me wrong. As 
just for the whole, you know, merging them together for another flavor. I mean, I, I try the pear and yeah, a little bit peary. But is that just because you're thinking about a pear? Uh, well, if that's the case, it's still working. I'm still tricking myself to think I've made pear. <laughs> that's true. So the lollies are fine. They taste great. Most of the other, most of the natural confectionery ones do. In terms of miss, uh, like squashing flavors together to make new ones. Yeah. Uh, I, mm. Yeah. I feel like this would be maybe more of like a kids party thing and kids would have fun putting them together and eating oh, them yeah. and, and well, you know just having a bit of a laugh but kids are pretty easy to sway <laughs> if that makes i don't want to call them dumb because they're not but they've got a lot more imagination and i yeah. think if they think they've built something nice oh, I've they're more likely to believe it exactly and <laughs> yeah. i think that's what they're aiming for yeah this is this is definitely one for the kids rather than adults um if you like the natural confectionery co lollies again these do have those same, like same sort of taste but you might as well just get like a regular like mixed fruit bag or get something. one of their other yeah. types yeah I mean, they're fine. Yeah. <laughs> if you enjoyed watching this video, give us a thumbs up. Let us know in the comments section down below what you think you could make out of these flavors. Could you make something that genuinely tastes like something else? I, I'm surprised you only make, put two together too, because obviously once you do that, you can't really you can't really stack them per se. No. Unless you call two a stack. Well, I mean, look, they're they're putting a flat one on top, but well, then I suppose. Hmm. Hmm. Anyway, um, I've, I've forgotten what I've said now. Nathan interrupted. But thanks for watching and, and, and subscribe. Sounds good. Bye-bye.